Hey, hey guys, what's going on? Kelly here, and I'm playing Domination on Radi- What? Playing Team Deathmatch on Radiation. Jesus, I don't know why I wanted to say Domination. I think it's because it's like Radiation Domination. I don't know, they sound- They end in a sh- Do not Sh- Whatever. I don't really know how to say that. Whatever. Okay, now I'm just confused. Anyway, this isn't a perfect game, but there's like two to three minutes where I go after what I thought was two campers, but it's actually a guy with a tactical insertion camping. So that's amusing, and I don't know, I just thought it was an amusing game. It's not perfect, but it's, I go 20 and 8 or 20 and 6, something like that. But it's it's fun to watch. So, well, at least I thought it was fun to watch. I don't know what you guys would think. But I wanted to talk about my time paintballing at CPX Sports. Uh, this I did a commentary telling you guys to come out to the Chicagoland area to paintball with a bunch of commentators. Big commentators, by the way. I was like, I was probably like the second smallest, third smallest commentator there. So, I mean, in terms of like subscriber count, being known, whatever, however you want to say it. So it was like it was with the big guy, <laughs> and. You know, to be honest, I've heard stories about all of these people. I've, you know, they, some of them get a pretty bad rap in the community. But, you know, if you take their YouTube stuff, if you don't pay any attention to that, you know, whether you agree or disagree with it, doesn't matter. They were all really, really cool people, I found out. So, it was, you know, it was a lot of fun to meet them and hang out and have tons, tons of fun. So, I'm really glad I went. And in terms of the actual event, the paintballing event, with subscribers, like, we, you know, everyone did a video asking subscribers to come out, and a lot did. And it was really, really cool to meet subscribers. I, one of the, one of the weirder things was I signed a really nice leather wallet. They asked, the, a kid came up and asked me to sign his really nice leather wallet, and I don't know why you'd want to ruin your leather wallet, but <laughs> thanks. Thanks for being a subscriber, and it was, it was really, um, touching. To, to meet subscribers and, and how excited they can get and, and uh, it was just amazing. It was really amazing and, and I really enjoyed it. And a subscriber gave me a t-shirt. That was, that was pretty sweet. That was pretty badass. Tell you. <laughs> Anyways, now let's talk about the actual paintball match. I, I think you guys want to know how I did. So I've never paintballed in my life before. So when I got there, whatever, FPS uh, Russia hooked me up with some gear. So, you know, I went to practice range, practice a little bit, and so after that was the match, and like, I don't know, we had to wait like 20, 30 minutes for the match, but once it started, you know, I had my gun, and I was ready, and you guys know I'm impatient, so I had a hard time like waiting behind barriers, you know, to taking cover, so I would like to run between barriers, and I didn't get shot running between the barriers, I'm pretty fast, you know, I'm agile, and... So, you know, I you know, I took shots and stuff at people, but it was commentators versus the subscribers. So there were like it was like uh, 10, 12 uh commentators against like a lot, a lot of other people. So um I did shoot at someone in the shoulder. That was pretty sweet. And then of all places for me to get shot, I get shot in in the finger, in the fingernail. What the fuck? You know, I'm going to assume my hand was probably on my gun and that's when I got shot in the fingernail. But I like to think that I was actually having a really great conversation with the barrier that I was behind. And since I'm of an Italian uh, descent, I was moving my hands like, oh yeah, barrier, we're having a great game. This is going to be great. And I was just, you know, talking with my hands really hard and I got shot in the fingernail. Because I talk too hard with my hands, and that's what happened. So we're going to say that's what happened. Even though it kind of makes me look like a crazy person to be talking to a barrier. But whatever. Win some, you lose some. And then I was out. So I went one and one. <laughs> one KD. Whatever. I'll be better next time. Which there will be a next time. And I hope you guys will definitely come out. Uh, it was really fun. You know, the next event will be early September, so convince your parents to take you to the Chicagoland area, hang out, have a little vacation, have a weekend away with the fam, uh, if you're young and, and you, you know, you can't drive yourself. Um, if you're old enough, take a plane, take a car, come hang out, guys, uh, as long as you have the money. It was really fun, great weekend, just a blast. And anyways, after paintballing, we were going to go bowling and have beers, but uh, we went out to eat first and we kind of went out late. 
so by the time it was a Sunday, so um, bowling alleys were closed. It was <laughs> cut out of the restaurant at like 12:30, 1 a.m. It was a while. Uh, we had went to Applebee's and basically Apple. We just it was a lot of eating appetizers, like tons of appetizers. Uh, me and all the other commentators, by the way, this is like no more subscribe. You are gone. You are away from picture. <laughs> you are only allowed to paintball. That's it. <laughs> I'm just kidding, but we were all hanging out and just having appetizers and giggling. Like, really, that's all that happened at dinner was giggling and appetizers and just eating the appetizers. So it was tons of fun, and uh, we, then we just went back to the hotel. We all hung out and talked, and it was a really good time just meeting everyone, learning more about people. And, oh, also at the paintball event. <laughs> Uh, I this is a really funny story and you guys will see it eventually I'm sure but I got to see a dolphin dive by white boy who you guys know does the dolphin dive thing and he freaking <laughs> just ate some nasty ass shit as soon as he landed into the kiddie pool or whatever just shit in his mouth not not literal shit but I mean it was like decomposed paintball decomposed paintballs uh, and mud and, and wa uh, water and normal paintballs. I had, it, it looked gross. It was pretty disgusting. But the funny part was, a little kid who was one of his fans, he's like, I want to do it too. And this kid ran towards the pool and just freaking leaped in there. Got like, fucking like, uh, he got way high in there and just fucking landed on the hard ass ground. <laughs> And just paint, decomposed paintballs just went flying all over. It was really gross, but so funny to see this little kid just freaking leap. Oh man, it was, it was, it was amazing. <laughs> but I hope you guys have a good day.